everyone welcome back as you can see we are in a different location we're in new york city in my hotel room and i had a chance to go visit the Cezanne store twice and i took you with me so today i want to show you a little Cezanne haul Cezanne try on and it's actually a little Cezanne haul but the try on itself is massive i don't know how many items i got to try on in the store but it was a lot and i had a good time i really wanted to just not restrict myself to only the items that I typically gravitate towards. I really wanted to just experiment and see other possibilities. Maybe something would sparkle my interest. And so today I'm taking you with me. We're trying on different things at the Cezanne store. So I hope you enjoy it. The first piece I tried on is this Louisa jumper. I got this one in size medium. That was the smallest size they had in the store. And I really love the vibrant green color. The main composition of the this sweater is merino wool and mohair. I really like the balloon sleeves, the buttons, the little detail on the uh, cuff area. I just overall think it's such a great piece. Now this was in size medium. It was the smallest one they had in the store. I think I would have preferred size small. Obviously, if you like oversized, then the medium size would be great. But overall, I think sizing down is a good idea. It does run a little bit large. The next piece that caught my eye was the Betty cardigan. This was on my wish list as soon as it came out a couple of weeks ago. And this is made out of 100% merino wool. The size that I'm trying on here is small. Now I do have this cardigan in the white and black stripes and this is a piece that I wear on repeat. It's one of those pieces that is really easy to style and so I reach for it a lot. And so when this color came out I was really excited and um, I knew that I would get a lot of use out of it. So this actually came home with me. I do want to point out that I have sensitive skin and I always gravitate towards the Cezanne knits. Many of them I can't pull off simply because my skin is too sensitive but thankfully this cardigan which is also made out of 100% wool like I said doesn't bother me. I have no doubt that this is a piece that I'm gonna get a lot of wear out of simply based on the fact that I wear the other cardigan a lot and I as I said before I love green especially this sage deep green green color even though it is uh, part of the fashion trends at the moment for fall and winter in my eyes this is a timeless piece that I can pull out every single year okay, this next piece is another trending color at the moment uh, this burgundy I believe this is called the Emily cardigan and the one I tried on is in size extra small so as you can see it is quite oversized now this is made out of I believe alpaca as well as wool and overall I really love again the balloon sleeves the kind of oversized fit of this piece unfortunately it was a little bit itchy so I can't pull it off but I love the color I love the cut of this I just find it so effortlessly chic um, great for fall for winter maybe some of you remember I made a video a few years back um, this was when I was visiting New York and I went to the Cezanne store and I can't remember how many items I tried on but it was a lot um, I'll link it down below in case you haven't seen it and this cardigan was um, on my wish list and that was the first time that I tried on in this I think white color and I just I love it but unfortunately it's just not it doesn't do well with my sensitive skin this next piece uh, is this Martin crop trouser in this black and white pattern and I'm kind of kicking myself for not getting it every time I try on the Martin cropped trouser not the regular the cropped one I'm always so happy with the fit I feel like it's very flattering especially for somebody that's I would say medium height I'm almost five seven five six and a half and they just fit really well and they look very flattering now this one in particular is made i think out of 80 percent cotton and 20 percent linen and it feels really nice it's very comfortable um, i think i tried on let me double check size 36 36 which i think is a four and 
I uh, yeah it's a great trouser if you're looking for trousers definitely worth uh, looking into they are a straight leg wide fit so it's gonna be great with those boots for winter for fall time and this is also a trouser that you can easily transition into spring and summertime since it's made out of cotton and linen they hold you in really well but they're not uncomfortable because it is a wide leg and as I said it's very flattering so they're definitely on my wish list this might be an item that I order when I get back to LA I cannot do a lot of shopping because my suitcase when I came into New York was already heavy enough and so which wasn't the best idea I don't know what I was thinking I probably should have left a little room in case I purchased something but uh, this is something that I can order hopefully if it doesn't sell out because I know these trousers do sell out so um, but uh, yeah if you are looking for a pair of trousers definitely check these out the next piece is a little bit more fun this is something that I normally wouldn't gravitate towards it's this cropped jacket in this very vibrant blue color this is in size 4 and as I said earlier I just wanted to have a little bit of fun in the Cezanne store and so this is not something that I would typically uh, go for but nevertheless I think it's a great piece for fall for winter time I also tried on the Lulu trouser in black and this is in size 34 I would say the fit was great anything lower than that would have been too tight and anything higher would have been too loose as you can see they are a bit too long so if I did get them I would have to take them in I think they're just a really great classic trouser that you can wear either casually or um, for work the other pair of trousers that I tried on is this Caesar trouser and this one I am not exactly sure why I chose size 36 it's obviously way too big I think 34 would have been a perfect fit as you can see it's very uh, loose in the waist area it's too long I would definitely uh, have to take them into a tailor it was nice to try them on but it's definitely not a pair that I would um, go back to I think the composition I can't exactly remember but I think it was polyester and viscous which I am not too crazy about I really do look for more natural materials and a polyester is definitely not on top of my list here comes another pair of trousers this is called the Aldo trouser and this is again in size 34 which is a 2 and it was a pretty good fit as you can see again they are a bit longer I like the belt detail around the waist area I feel like it makes the trouser a lot more flattering especially for being wide leg now I wasn't too crazy about the material composition again I think it's 52% polyester 25% uh, wool a little bit of viscous which isn't too bad but overall in a perfect world I would prefer that they were not made out of polyester but that's just my preference obviously to each uh, their own I'm glad I tried them on and I'm also glad that I got them out of my system this next piece is the famous Gaspard cardigan I'm sure you have all seen this piece in other colors and this is the newest version a newest addition to the Gaspard family and I love these cardigans uh, but I can't wear them because of the composition I think it's mohair wool um, but I always try them on and so when they had this color I just thought maybe something has changed maybe I can wear them maybe my skin is not as sensitive but unfortunately that's not the case if you are one of those people that can wear them God bless you I am so happy for you because they are definitely a great piece to have in your closet they're timeless they're classic they have these little cute buttons such a beautiful detail and I just love this new color so I tried it on but unfortunately it did not make it into my shopping basket this next pair of trousers is in this khaki color and I really like them the fit was wonderful very flattering um, the length was pretty much perfect um, I could get away wearing them with a a boot something a little bit higher 
and overall I just love the details on the pockets you have the buttons uh, they do have a pocket in the back as well a zipper on the side and I just think they're such a great pair of trousers something that I definitely don't have in my closet now again I'm not too crazy about the material composition unfortunately but if you don't mind having a little bit of polyester in your clothes I think this is definitely such a beautiful piece for fall uh, for winter time moving on to the next piece and it's this really adorable red uh, sweater and they only had a medium the smallest size was medium but I still wanted to try it on just to see how it fit me how it looked I really like the feminine touches the balloon sleeves the little puffy shoulders it's such a beautiful pop of color for this season but unfortunately it was a little bit too itchy moving on to this pair of booties in this burgundy cherry color I got these last year in the cream version and I really do like them they're very comfortable this color is the newest addition they also had a khaki color as well that caught my attention I think both pairs are just gorgeous I really love how vibrant this color is such a great way to add a little bit of interest to your outfit these are the trending colors at the moment but in my opinion they are timeless and classic I have a feeling if you invest in any of these colors you can still take them out every single year and put them to good use now I also wanted to try this pair of jeans as well in this cream version very classic comfortable and overall I just really like the fit uh, I can see investing in this piece in the future I didn't want to get it because as we all know jeans are quite heavy and so putting it in my suitcase could have been an issue for me at the airport but overall I think they're just a really fantastic pair of jeans the next piece I gotta hurry this up because my battery just died I don't know how long this video is gonna be I hope you don't mind but the next piece that I tried on was this Chelsea jacket in size 36 and it felt really battery when I tried it on I was so surprised because typically when you try on uh, this kind of blazer it typically is more stiff but this felt really soft and very battery even though the composition is mostly I think half of it is polyester which again why 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 but okay I'm not gonna go into it I think you heard me complain about it long enough so I will say I was so surprised by how soft it is now I have something quite similar in my wardrobe and so I definitely don't need another one so out of all the items that I tried on I'll show you the one that actually came home with me or is coming home with me we're still in New York let me get it it's right here all right it is this green cardigan or oh, maybe I already mentioned it I think I already mentioned it in the video but well anyways here it is this beauty is coming home with me I just uh, I just think it's such a beautiful piece and I'm excited to add it to my wardrobe okay so I'm gonna end here thank you so much for watching and I will see you soon bye